YouTube. Hey, we back. We back with another one. Hey, we went fishing a little while ago, and and uh, it, it took a big turn. I know my my grandma I went fishing at my grandma's pond, and I mean she's been having a lot of a lot of beaver troubles, and I mean they tore up her pier, and the dam is just causing a lot of a lot of drainage problems and everything. So she said whenever I see them, to just you know do what I gotta do to get rid of, uh, get rid of them. So in this video. You will see, I'm gonna cut out the, probably the fishing part. I didn't really do much. I mean, I got a couple bites, but wasn't nothing major. Um, so in the, in, the, in the video, you'll see me um, just out there at the pond, me and my fiance, and she's gonna be the one recording. Video isn't the best. It wasn't a planned video. Uh, it was just something that I told her to record. Uh, I was gonna try to upload it to YouTube. So in this video, you will see uh, her record me as it was two beavers originally that came across the uh, pond, and I took a shot at both of them, and both of them ended up going in the water. And uh, then a couple minutes later, I think another one had popped up. It ended up being like three or four beavers, and which, which we ended up killing all four of them. But in the video, you'll, video you only see that I retrieved two of them. Uh, the other two didn't float up till later on that day, and I ended up getting them out the next day. But um, but yeah, we got we got rid of that problem in one day. It was it was a crazy, crazy. I don't think I ever seen that many in them at one time in in a pond. But um, I guess it was a whole family of them. But yeah, we ended up getting rid of those, getting rid of the problem. Uh, the pond's doing good now, so I'm gonna uh, show y'all kind of what happened. Uh, and bear with me, the video isn't the best, but uh, you can kind of see a little bit of a couple shots here and there and i got a picture at the end that shows the two biggest ones all the two are a little bit smaller but uh yeah stay tuned and uh deer season's coming up shortly uh both season starts next month got about three weeks i believe so uh hopefully i can kill some and get some on footage and drop some of that and we also gonna have a, probably have a recap coming up and also the part two of the kennel build uh we also added a rabbit pen and couple more different stuff you'll you'll see i'm um, planning on making that video shortly um and yes yeah, stay tuned and make sure you like subscribe share with a friend and uh yeah i'll holler at y'all peace mm, he sends danger oh, he ran away mm -hmm. he sends the danger just stay still he might come close to something that might be able to get him danger on that one. As soon as he get close to me, I'm going to go ahead and get him. Oh, he's circling that one. Oh, peek. Don't go under yet. Please don't go under. Oh! Get that one. I thought you could see. Hmm? I thought you could see. See right here. Where? I got him. Where? Right, right there, there with them there. bubbles. Mm -hmm. Oh, he going in this, in this dam. Damn. He might go in there and die. If I hit him. I might not have hit him. But this one, he going to sink down. Because I know I hit him for sure. And he'll come back up in a little bit.
ain't see no blood, but he definitely got hit. Right here. Oh. Shoot it again. Shoot it again. He done. Still moving. Mm, look at them teeth. That's what they chew that wood up with. Well, that's two of them.